The blended intensive program is being implemented for the first time at the Opole University of Technology. We are hosting our international partners from Lithuania, Portugal and the Czech Republic. In general, eight academic teachers and 22 students are involved in this particular blended intensive program. Uh, they represent the Vilnius Collegia in Lithuania, the Institute Poly Polytechnic Institute in Tomar, Portugal, the University of Finance and Administration in Prague in the Czech Republic, and of course, Opole University of Technology. The blended intensive program is based on mixed education. It includes both the virtual and the physical components. And in November, we had a series of online lectures and Currently, during this whole week, we are hosting our international partners in the Opole, at the Opole University of Technology, at the Faculty of Economics and Management. This particular blended intensive program is uh, dedicated to the broad issue of diversity management. All the presentations were very interesting and we are very happy with the result we achieved. Erasmus Plus Blended Intensive Program is a short-term mobility program combining classroom and online learning. It is organized by minimum three universities from different countries. During the program, students or university staff undertake a short-term physical mobility abroad and a compulsory virtual component facilitating collaborative online learning experience and teamwork. Blended intensive program topics may include challenge-based learning in which international teams work together to address the challenges of the modern world, sustainable development goals and other social challenges faced by specific groups, regions, cities, companies or institutions. First impression about the Poly, it's about very most cultural uh, city. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a very beautiful Christmas market, and most beautiful buildings were never seen mm -hmm. and galleries. First impression in Alpo is like people are really nice; mm -hmm. that they treat you very well, mm -hmm. and I feel like I'm home. Overall, people speak English, it is good also, and like I was really happy because I never had any issues to buy something or to communicate with someone, so it is quite good. During BIP program, we are working on a strategy for Technology Park in Opole uh, to encourage women to get involved uh, into startups, to make business, to get more involved in the business world. Mostly we were talking about the diversity of people and how we can manage it and understanding more or less different cultures. Working with uh, students from other countries, it's, it's actually really interesting because uh, they have uh, different uh, uh, perspectives, they have different, like, uh, uh, they are just different and it's like very interesting to get to know other people. I think uh, working in a group uh, it's very better than work alone because we share our experience, uh, our different point of view and can create a really complete thing. I recommend uh, to all of uh, our students to get involved in this program because it's a great opportunity uh, to meet people from other countries, to learn culture and to um, work with other people who have the same aspiring uh, ideas as you. Uh, I would uh, recommend them to take a part of uh, this program because first uh, uh, you have networking. Uh, in the future if you will start some business or you will be working in some corporate, you will already have some people who know you know from other countries and you never know what they can start or what they will do, so it is very beneficial for you. Second one, it's not only study, but also you can have fun, meet new people, new culture, learn about it, and then it's very interesting. This is really amazing thing, really amazing experience, and I recommend it for everybody. It's 
he has working with BIP or any other project in another country, I think is very good for uh, experiences in life because you counter everything in your life in different, even if you're in the same country. So I think it's good for you to work on that and to accept people and accept the difference between the countries or everything. Life lessons come one in the